right, guys, welcome back, and welcome to Tartaria Tour Chicago, part one. Um, this one I am excited to do because Chicago is my hometown. That's where I was born. That's where I was raised. I've been in New York for about the past 10 years, but well, all the other time I was in Chicago. So Chicago is a beautiful city, wonderful town right in the Midwest. And today we're going to be looking at the two last standing buildings from the World's Fair. If you look right on the left with the dome, this building we see with the dome directly to the left of the lady. Um, we're going to be focusing on that today, but just look at the rest of this right now. Look at these extraordinary structures that they had during the World's Fair. Look at these. Like, this is massive. And if you've been close to the ones that are still standing, uh, you have a really hard time believing that they built these just as temporary structures. Like, look at that. It's amazing. If you zoom in, there's Chinese characters on that dome right there. Now let's zoom in out again. There's the lake. There's the Columbia statue. And right to the left, we've got this dome building we're going to be getting on the ground with. But look at these all around. It's quite amazing. I would love to have seen all this in its heyday. Look at the people. Look how tiny the people are in there. All right, so here's from another view. I think this is the same building. And what's interesting is someone told me that this building was uh, one of the smallest from the World's Fair. So they kept the smallest ones. All right, now we're about to ride out into the, um, the building as it stands currently. This was taken in the summer. So look at that. Walking up to it, there it is. Look at that beauty. Look at that dome on top of there. Look at all those details. Looks like something was taken off the top. If you go back and look at the building from the front, in the beginning, it looked like there was a little bit more on top. But I think there was a lot more on top of there. Look at those shelves, all these details in here. These could have been redone. There's lion faces on there. I used to come here all the time when I was little. And look at that green roof, the copper roof, copper top again. Copper is the conductor. Beautiful pillars. And in front of there is the water, the lake. All the statues, all the details up there. Got the pillars, big doors. Statues. Mud flood on the bottom. Look at that. Eternal construction on old buildings like this. Copper top again. Look at those spikes up there. great building. Now it's called the Museum of Science and Industry. But it was like an art center during the World's Fair. Yeah, and then we get a closer look at the pond and the other domes on the other side. A lot of these buildings always have three domes. Two on either side and one big one in the middle. It's the same in Columbia here in New York. Gotta be geometrical. For the geometrical purposes or something. So I'm going to let this kind of play out. Enjoy. Enjoy the music. It's my own compositions. If you'd like to support, uh, there'll be a link in the description of my music. You can purchase my music if you want. And also I did um, my first Tartaria NFT today. So if you're into crypto and stuff like that and want to support that way, 
That would be awesome too. All right, hope you enjoy. I'll be back soon to uh, make an announcement about the next area. Look at those ducks, geese, copper doors. Look at the huge doors. Now we left the Museum of Science and Industry and we are entering this. This is also in the same area. You got the fasces on the bottom. This is the statue that was in the first old picture. Uh, it's a replica. It's a smaller replica it, as it says on there. It says the, the original was uh, much bigger than that. But it's still incredible to see this drive around. It's in a little circle area for traffic 
and the grass, grass was a little overgrown. But pretty interesting. You got the fascias on all four sides of there. And we're about to go into the Art Institute, which is further north, central area of the city. So here's the original pictures of the Art Institute. You've got that spire right in the middle. You see the mud all over the place. You see the built up. It seems like they just freshly finished building the stairs and covering the mud flood windows in the bottom. Look at that. They covered up the windows there. Maybe the window tacks. Look at that big spire. Here's from the other angle. So look at that. We got mud flood. Mud flood mania. Old cars. Look how small the people are. Look at that. Mud flood windows right there on the flower. And here's the inside, more modern. Uh, but you can still see the arches. You can still see some of the old world stuff in there. And look at that. You got St. Petersburg picture in the back. Pretty mystical. Pretty dope. And there it, it is today. So now we're going to go on the ground there. So here it is as it stands today. Still windows blocked up, still you see mud flood. Um, but this was like an auxiliary building in during the World's Fair, uh, as the books say, and stuff like that. So and we got the shell again, like was on the Science and Industry building. Got a lot of details in here. I personally like the other building better. This is still a cool building. It's got a lot of details when I get up close. But um, I just wanted to have these two in this episode. Got Obama there. Um, Obama portraits. Just wanted to have both um, buildings in this episode. The two last standing from the Chicago World's Fair because it's such a pivotal point for uh, us researchers. Um, so many anomalies with the fair, destroying the amazing buildings afterwards and temporary structures, um, and then leaving the two smallest structures. I had stairs up the mud flood area, mud flood mania. So I'm gonna leave you with some more of my music. Again, there'll be a link in the bio there. Please subscribe uh, if, you, if you like this channel. It's got lions on there, walking in, walking up the stairs. And we got buffalo heads there. That's really interesting. Super interesting. Never seen that on another museum or anything like that. But I have seen it on a few apartment buildings here in New York. Got the flowers. And so many buildings in Chicago got a hit. But all right, guys, have a great day. Enjoy the rest of this.
the Art Institute. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, like, and comment. TartariaTour.com for all the other info, Instagram, NFTs, all of it. Peace.